Hello and welcome back to the channel. This prophetic word excerpt comes from Nate Johnston, Dallas, Texas. We are in a 222 moment. I had a dream a few nights ago. My revivalist friend handed me a key. It had Daniel 222 written on it. He reveals deep and hidden things. He knows what lies in darkness, and light dwells with him. In my dream, my friend then simply looked at me and said, Now go. When I woke up, I began to write down all of these revelations that just gushed out of me. You see, we are in a moment where God is wanting us to pick up our authority again where we have forfeited it. We are in a moment of breaking powerlessness and defeat that we've settled into and violently shaking off the bonds of weariness. We are in a moment of leaving survival and the camp of stuck and shipwreck that we've been in. We are in a moment of occupy and increase, not in a season of maintenance. We are in a moment of recovery and recompense. We are in a moment of wrong doors closing and promised doors opening. We are in a time of unlocking of places, resources, areas that have been locked up and out of our access for some time. We are in a time of entering promises that we've been contending for for three, seven, or maybe even ten year periods. We are exiting doors and alignments that have kept us stuck and limited. We are in a moment of pursuing doors, jumping out at God's opportunities that we've missed in past season. We are in a kairos time of obtaining what has felt unobtainable in the past. The doors that have looked as though they are the most shut, they are about to fling wide open. This is for those who have been waiting for their go again. You see, the Lord said, There is a commissioning call that's going forth in this hour. It's for my laid down lovers who have not been seeking doors of opportunity, but have been seeking me, my remnant, my set aside, my set apart ones, my holy forerunners. In this hour, I am branding them with the message that I've reserved for this moment. I'm branding them with my heartbeat that will shake the earth and bring it back to my heart. I'm going to use them to overturn. They're going to overturn wickedness and darkness in secret and dark places. I'm going to use them to turn back nations back to me once again. But many have said, but I'm stuck. And they have said, but I'm in a bind. I do not know my own way forward. But no, they've not been stuck. They've been in processing and refining and preparing. But now they're about to step into an increased season of hearing. They're about to step into the window of revelation season and receive fresh manna. They will pick up their keys again and run to the nations. Watch now as dead movements come back to life. Watch now as dead places begin to come back to life. And watch now as streams begin to flow in the desert once again. Watch now as doors begin to open that have looked closed and shut. Hearts that have been closed suddenly become soft again. This is a time where I'm reshaping my church. I'm molding my church. I'm forming my bride. So get ready, my my mighty ones. Set aside. Get ready. Pay attention to what I give you in the night seasons. Posture yourself before me. This is not a time to run ahead of me. This is a time to run with me. This is a time to be sensitive to me and my leading and be clothed by my spirit. Let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, Lord, we thank you that we can be in this moment, Father, together. Lord Jesus, I just pray right now, right now, Lord, that we would be seen as those laid down lovers of you, Father, seeking after you before open doors. We know that your word says that when we seek you first, all these things, Father, all these things come to us, Father, and we thank you for these open doors. Lord, may we walk through these open doors, Father. Lord, may you reveal deep and hidden things to us. And Lord, may we help to shine a light to those areas of darkness that we need to shine a light to. Lord, if it's in my own heart, shine the light. If it's in my community, Father, or in some place, Father, that I have not yet reached, help me, Father, to be a carrier of that light, the light of your presence, Father. May we pick up those keys again. May those two, two, two doors, may they swing wide open, Father. Thank you, Lord. 
Thank you, Lord, that we are in a moment of wrong doors closing and promised doors opening. Unlock doors in the life of my friend. Unlock doors in my own life. In Jesus' mighty name, amen.